Takis Mikas is a journalist who's made enemies in Greece. These photos, published in his book, show Greek volunteers who fought for the Serbs in Bosnia, an obscure tale in a terrible war. He says some 100 Greeks fought against the Bosnian government, with tacit support from the Greek state. They were treated like heroes. They were given prominence. They were, and nobody at any point tried to stop them. At no point did the think Greek justice think about calling these people and investigating not necessarily their own participation in crimes, but their knowledge of potential crimes so that Greece could assist the International Tribunal at The Hague. But did Greek volunteers have anything to do with this, the massacre of Muslims by Serbs at Srebrenica? The man who's suing Takis Mikas for libel told me he was in Bosnia but not in Srebrenica when it fell to the Serbs. He would not give us an interview. This is the port of Kavala in northern Greece. And we've come here because it's the home of one of the Greek volunteers who fought in the Bosnian war. And he's agreed to speak to us. His name is Kyriakos. He's proud that he fought for the Serbs in the hills around Sarajevo, he says, for the dignity of Greece. He had already returned home when Srebrenica fell. When the battles happened, a small Greek unit went into the town and raised Greek flags. They telephoned me and they told me all about this. It was a big thing for the Serbs to occupy Srebrenica. But the Greeks did not take part in the battle itself. Feelings ran high in Greece during the breakup of Yugoslavia. These protests against NATO involvement in Kosovo. So was it traditional anti-Americanism or something deeper? that caused this pro-Serb feeling. For the last 200 years, we've sort of run parallel courses. These are people who are orthodox people. These were people who were subjects, abused subjects of the Ottoman Empire, people who were treated very, quite badly in their own land. So we have a kind of parallel history of a people who, in fact, for the last thousand years, are very close, whose histories and whose fates are very closely intertwined. Easy to forget on the gentle waters of the Aegean, the deep ties that link Greece to troubled Balkan lands further north. Barnaby Phillips, Al Jazeera, Greece.